The idea behind the Heart Center Intensive Care Unit was to combine the specialties of cardiology intensive care, cardiac anesthesia, and cardiac surgery into a unified care team model to take care of the entire span of patients of acute critical cardiovascular illness. So we have physicians who are board certified in cardiology and intensive care, in cardiac anesthesia and in intensive care, and in cardiac surgery and in intensive care. By bringing together this multidisciplinary group, we hope to best take care of patients who are peri-procedure from the cath lab or the EP lab, who are perioperative from the cardiac OR, who may need evaluation or management of mechanical circulatory support. And so these physicians all have an intimate background in these specific areas. Moreover, there's a lot of data showing that patients in the modern cardiac intensive care unit face a number of non-cardiac comorbidities, including sepsis, renal failure, and respiratory failure. And our intensive care group is designed to treat not only the cardiac, but all the non-cardiac comorbidities for these patients. And so one thing that all of us in the field know is that the cardiac intensive care unit is not the same unit or the same patient population that it was 10 or even five years ago. The patients are generally sicker and have more acute cardiac and hemodynamic abnormalities, which require new therapies. So we really need a specialized program of training to build the physician to be able to be at the bedside and managing not only a mechanical circulatory support device that is supporting the patient minute to minute, but also their general cardiac context, as well as all non-cardiac comorbidities, which include failures of organs, uh, including the lungs, the kidneys, um, or the liver. Our goal at Massachusetts General Hospital is to study what the best care model is for cardiac intensive care. There's a growing but still limited database of uh, care models and care design. So there's a small study from the University of Maryland that showed intensivist involvement in ventilated cardiac intensive care unit patients reduced length of stay and actually reduced costs. It was a large trial in Korea, a quasi-experimental design that studied 2,400 patients over three years, and the presence of a dedicated cardiac intensivist actually reduced mortality for overall CCU patients. So our goal at Massachusetts General Hospital is to bring our intensive care unit team to the bedside 24-7 to provide acute life-saving care to these patients. and our. Other goals are to tr make sure we train the next generation of physicians. So my own personal goal is to really build a training fellowship for cardiologists to go on to get specialized training in critical care and to fulfill these roles across the country in the future.